could have been killed. Coolest, says the guy, have some more of the old sporrant juice. <laughs> so the priest gives the bottle a good see and two, and says, why are you not drinking, my son? The fellow says, I don't think so, I'll just sit here and wait for the law. <laughs> Hi, we're, we're Abba. Abba. And Kenny, Kenny Everett asked us to be on his show tonight, but we said no. <laughs> It's not that I don't love you anymore, Sydney. It's just that, well, things change. We've been married now for eight years. Eight good years. We've had our ups and downs, but we've always struggled. By these enormous whirling brushes, and they keep whipping and lashing at my body, and all my clothes fall off. And suddenly this garage attendant comes towards me with his dipstick, and he plunges it into one of the brushes, and the whole car wash blows up! And we land in this potato patch, and we're surrounded by those crazy hillbillies who keep plucking at their banjos. <laughs> no one telling you the plot. Go and see it, Michael. It's all done in the best possible taste. And, and now, now something else. else. Hello, my little cheap there at terms. <laughs> you know, I have been getting around to see this country by train. What do they call them? Have it away days. <laughs> oh, you know. Oh, I love the train. What is this show we're watching? It's the Kenny Everett television show. Are we on it? No. Thank, Thank God. God. 